Okay, I'm joined with Keith Mayo, Swinner Boxing Promoter, and Mark Nielsen and Tony Nielsen of Nielsen Boxing. Keith, there's a, an exciting new tie-up between yourself and the Nielsens. Can you explain you know, to us um, what it's all about? Yeah, I mean, I just want to take the, um, uh, the professional side here in Swindon to the next level, and uh, Tony and Mark are going to assist in that all being well. And that's what we propose to do, starting off with this first show here. Yeah, tell us a bit more about the first show that you've got coming up. Uh, in this show, it's like a, a small show, if you like. We've got Ryan Martin that we're going to get out for an eight rounder. He's had four bouts, four wins. Uh, so we're going to step him up. And we've got three other boxers making a debut. Uh, so at the moment, it's going to be Ryan Martin and the three debuts. Uh, and it's going to be at Grange Drive Leisure Centre on the 27th of June. Tell us about the other three on, on the bill as well. It's called New Generation, I understand. New Generation, because you know they are a new generation. So we got um, a lad from Yeovil, Brim Wayne, yeah. who's a light heavyweight. Um, he's been in the gym since about November, and he's ready to go now. Uh, we got a young lady, um, Kelly Morgan, a middleweight. Uh, an exciting lady, be some surprising for a lot of people to see if she boxes actually. And we got a really exciting lad who just signed with us, uh, Akeem Ennis Brown, better known as Riddy, a lightweight, um, with a great amateur career, and again, a very exciting boxer. So, it's all in all, it's looking good, it's going to be an exciting show. So, you encourage people to start getting their tickets now? Yeah, definitely, yeah. yeah the tickets are, are available as of now. Uh, we'll have the posters, etc., uh, as from next week. Um, you get the tickets from any of the boxers from the website kmpromotions.co.uk or from the um, venue itself at Grange Drive. Excellent. Mark and Tony, I'll come to you guys. Excited about the new tyre? Absolutely. Uh, it's exciting times ahead. We've um, started off in the white collar scene uh, about eight, nine years ago and we've built that to be, um, over recent times, some of the biggest shows in the, in the country. Uh, with Keith being a dominant pro promoter locally for the last six, seven years, and with us sort of probably thinking we've done our time in white collar, it just seemed a natural progression to tie up with Keith, work together on the, on the promotional activities of it, and see if we can you know, take the, the, these pro shows to the next level. And there's some exciting times ahead, like Keith said, calling it the um, new generation, with some recent exciting new fighters coming through the ranks. Excellent. Tony, I believe it's going to be a dinner show, isn't it? So something a little bit a little bit different? Yeah, well, it's not a sit-down meal. We've got um, a buffet for the VIPs. Um, so it will be It's a little bit different to the normal shows that we've had in the past, or Keith's had. Um, we're just trying to make a little bit of a twist on it, to always try and make something a little bit different and add our, add our twist to it, really. Um, but, yeah, like to recap on really what Mark said as well, um, I mean, I've known Keith, we both have actually for, for a number of years, and it's been great to sort of get involved and, and be sort of Keith's understudy, really, and uh, let, let, him, let him teach us what he knows, really. Um, looking forward to it, so can't yeah. wait. Well, boxing's going through a bit of a renaissance over recent years, nationally, but also so much locally. There's uh, quite a number of boxing shows from the amateurs through to the pros. And uh, with Keith, as I said, dominating it for the last seven years, and I think uh, Ricky Porter did it back in the day. You know, Swindon's got a good history of pro boxing. Uh, this time we're actually at Grange Le Leisure Centre for uh, the first time. Um, trying to do it a little bit different. We still, you know, Keith's the main pro uh, promoter at the Oasis. And we're, this is a smaller venue with a smaller card, as Keith said, with uh, Ryan Martin as an eight band at the top of the bill. And I'm sure that's going to be a sellout. Yeah, sure. Keith? Any opponents in mind as, as yet, or do you know when they, they're going to be announced? Um, we've got a couple in mind, but I won't say too much about them at the moment until it's confirmed. But hopefully by the end of the week we might have at least two, if not more, confirmed. Um, but it's going to be an exciting show. You've been going seven years now um, in Swindon, promoting shows, also in, in Gloucester and various other venues. Still enjoying it as much as ever? Oh yeah, I love it. Great buzz, yeah. And especially when you see these new lads and lasses uh, coming through. They've got so much to offer, so it's good to bring them through and see how far they can go. And there'll likely be more more talent coming through because there is so much talent in Swindon right now, isn't there? Yeah, there's another couple of people we're already looking at, are considering going pro, and so as they're ready, and you know we think they're ready, we'll bring them through and get them out there and see what they got. Okay, the press launch is going to be very soon for, for this show. What do people have to do to get tickets? Uh, yeah. I'll answer this one. Yeah, tickets, as Keith said earlier, available on the website, kmpromotions.co.uk. Any of the boxers, 
um, and their and, and the, the um, partners, any, anyone, it'll be widely advertised in the next week yeah. or two. Facebook, Twitter, all the social media sites have a link to the to the website and everywhere. So uh, once it's launched, we'll be there. Excellent. Well, thanks guys for joining me, and best of luck with Thank the show. You. Thank you very much. Yeah, thanks. Cheers.